Guys, ever since Yolanda uttered this statement last night, internet have not been the same again. Internet have not really been the same again. A lot of people are dragging Yolanda, calling out Yolanda. Some people are seriously dragging Big Brother, calling out Big Brother, tagging people to tag Big Brother, calling on Big Brother, telling Big Brother the reason why it is very, very necessary to disqualify Yolanda at this particular point in time. And some people are saying that Big Brother should disqualify Yolanda with immediate effect. Ah, God, honestly speaking, it is a whole lot. A lot of things is seriously happening on social media. Why would I wait for Big Brother's verdict? Because it is Big Brother's house, Big Brother's rule, Big Brother's VAR. Big Brother, you know, Big Brother is definitely going to use his VAR to critically look into this matter and decide on what to do and what not to do. But if it is left for people on social media, they really want Big Brother to disqualify Yolanda immediately. In fact, Papa Ghost fans, they are all over social media saying that Yolanda wants to molest Papa Ghost. Honestly, I was shocked. I was surprised. I was just like, wow. Wow. Some people on social media, they can cook anyways. They said Papa Ghost need to be protected at all costs and Yolanda need to be disqualified from the show because for Yolanda to be making those utterances why on why she was on Papa Ghost bed stuck naked that she really need to be disqualified. Other people were of the opinion that Yolanda is now making other housemates very very uncomfortable that you could see how Sinaye ran away immediately Yolanda made those utterances to see that the men they are now scared they are now uncomfortable and the Yolanda is now making them very very uncomfortable in the house meanwhile some Bravo B fans and some Makeke fans are seriously saying if Bravo B could be disqualified from the show for making similar utterances that they do not see any reason why Big Brother would not disqualify Yolanda from the show. Guys, just watch till the end of this particular video because we are in for another interesting hot gist that I know you wouldn't want to miss out from any part of. So go ahead, watch till the end of this particular video, subscribe to my channel, click on the notification bell button, and do not forget to like, share this particular video with your friends and loved ones that loves big brother just because i upload multiple videos daily telling you all most of the things happening in big brother and zamzi season 4 mansion so guys yolanda in her drunken state last night found herself on papa ghost bed then she called and reached out for mpumi who answered her immediately guys why yolanda was calling mpumi sinaye willy liema and makeke they were downstairs, seriously paying attention to find out why Yolanda would be calling Mpumi on Papa Ghost's bed. So the moment Yolanda now told Mpumi her intention of effing want to molest somebody, Sinaye and Willie did not take it down well. In fact, the way they reacted and analyzed it at that particular moment, it was shocking. In fact, that I, I really think their reaction to it even fueled the way social media received that statement. Guys, just take a look at how Sinaye and the Willy reacted to that. I don't want to repeat what she just said, bro. No, 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 no. Guys, the moment Sinaye heard that, he automatically and quickly ran out from that conversation. As according to him, he said, that's some strike triggering statement and he does not want to be part of that conversation at all even when willie was saying could you hear what she said she said she wants to effing molest somebody guys sinaye wasn't really you know intending he didn't in any way wanted to be part of that conversation in fact even when lima was trying to draw him back for him to come and explain the meaning of that sinaye immediately ran out and quickly excused himself from that conversation 
Liema, who was there, it may seem as though she didn't really get the meaning of what Yolanda said as she was seriously trying to find out, seriously looking for somebody that would explain what that exactly mean. Striking touch it. Yeah. Guys, that was how Makeke now said it is a very, very jubadizing one, a striking type of shit. And Leoma was curiously, you know, trying to look for who will explain to her the exact meaning of what Yolanda said, what Yolanda actually said. Guys, that was how the statement, the conversation, and everything went on social media courts. Twitter courts to be precise. Twitter courts now we are analyzing, dissecting, looking into the matter, using their VAR to look into the matter. Then after they have properly looked into it on social media, dragging Yolanda, calling her all sorts of names, saying all manner of things, Papa Ghost fans inheriting the whole thing, saying that um, um, Big Brother should please protect Papa Ghost at all costs because Yolanda is intending to defy him, to molest him, to do this one, to do that one. They now arrived that Big Brother must disqualify Yolanda from the show. In fact, they were of the opinion that this same thing that Yolanda said, it is the exact same thing Bravo B said that got him disqualified from the show. In fact, they rooted out, they excavated, they assumed the video of Makeke and Bravo B conversation. Then they now said it is exact same thing. No difference between what Bravo B said and what Yolanda said to Mpumi. Guys, me, I was just asking myself, really? Really, could we say uh, truly that there was no difference between Bravo B and uh, Yolanda's statement? Honestly speaking, if we are going to be very, very honest with ourselves, guys, there is slight, in fact, it was not slight there is big difference even though i'm not supporting that kind of conversation or that kind of you know statement coming from anybody i really think okay big brother have to address it in his own possible way honestly if big brother decides to dish punishment to yolanda for saying that honestly i do not think anybody will fault him for that but why would await big brother's verdict as people are seriously calling him to do something and disqualify yolanda from the show i do not really think that yolanda really need to be disqualified from the show or deserve to be disqualified from the show because of her utterances people that are comparing yolanda's utterances with that of bravo b i think they are seriously making mistake the way bravo b talked about his own and the way he had his target and the way he even went as far as saying that um jared Sinaye, they are weakly. They couldn't do anything. That if they were the one in Jared and Sinaye's position, that they would have done something long time ago. Guys, did you all forget about all of that? So anybody that is saying what Yolanda said is is that the same thing with what Bravo B said? I really think that that is that's just coming out of hate you know people who always cook on social media and we are, are used to that type of cooking on social media you know people will heighten and amplify things on social media well we are patiently and seriously looking forward to see how big brother is actually going to handle this before then i really think that we should just drink chill pee and relax this is where I'll be ending this particular video. Go ahead, let me know your thoughts. Subscribe to my channel. Click on the notification bell button, please.